Hello everybody, my name is Audrey Vetters, here in Makeup Artists for the Fashion and Entertainment Industries. Today, I am going to be giving a tutorial on how to correctly and easily apply false lashes. This is going to be very useful for many of you, especially in this upcoming holiday season and any another special event that you may have throughout the year. I hope it is of your liking. Enjoy! These are our tools for today and the very first thing we need to do is to choose the type of false lashes we're going to be using. They could be more dramatic or more natural depending the type of the event that we have or the look we want to achieve. Lash glue, it comes in black and see-through. Tweezers in shape of shears and little scissors with a pointy ends. Our model for today is Ivy. Ivy is beautiful and the very first thing we need to do is to pull our lashes from the little plastic container. You will see that they come in a plastic base where they've been previously attached to with glue. This is at the outer corners of our lashes, the inner corners of our lashes, and we need to make sure that we know which is the outer corner and the inner corner. We're going to bend this plastic base where they previously come attached and with the help of our index finger and our thumb pull from the outer corner being very gentle and careful not to break them, not to damage them. Now with our tweezers we're going to get them right from the middle and the thing that we need to do first is tailor them to the size of our eyes. I'm gonna go right from the middle, making sure that they fit perfectly well in the inner corner. And I already see that there are two little groups of lashes, two little groups of hair of lashes in the outer corner that I'm gonna need to cut. If I need to cut anything, it has to be from the outer corner only. So right here are lashes. And we're going to cut two little groups of hairs from the outer corner. We're going to do it right here in the close-up so you know what I'm talking about. One and two. And I'm going to nip right in there. If we need to cut our lashes, always in, they need to be cut from the outer corner not from the inner corner. And we're gonna use what is remaining. Now we have a perfectly well fit lash to fit from the outer into the inner corner of our eyes. And we're gonna get a hold of them with our fingers and at the two corners. And we're gonna bend them very careful upwards being very careful not to damage them and this is gonna make the track that they come in more manageable, more pliable to be able to fit perfectly well. You see, that is the top of our lash, making sure that it, that is the top of our lash, getting from the two corners and bend them upwards. This is going to make this lash to fit perfectly well next to our lash line. It's going to make our lashes more pliable. We're going to pull a little bit of lash glue, making sure that we don't have too much. And wherever is it and at the tip of the applicator, we're going to brush it into the track. Brush it into the track, making sure we don't apply too much. Also, we need to make sure that the outer corner and the inner corner of our lash has enough glue so they don't come off. With our tweezers, we're gonna get them right from the middle, right at the middle. We're gonna clean our finger and wait five to 10 seconds for this glue to get a little bit sticky tacky and we're gonna place them next to the lash line first at the middle 
we're gonna go into the inner corner, the outer corner, making sure that they are really, really next to our last line. And with our help of our fingers, bring the inner corner down, making sure they are next to our last line. Bring the inner corner down and the outer corner up to give us a more almond shape. You see? We don't want these lashes to be sticking up. It, they may give us like a plastic doll look. We don't want that. We don't want beautiful, sexy, dreamy eyes. We're gonna go with our left eye and we're gonna do the technique again. Once again, from the outer corner of our left lash, we're gonna cut two little hair groups right in the track. We're gonna apply glue, just brush it into the track, making sure that we don't have we don't apply too much, and making sure that the outer corner and the inner corner of our lashes have enough glue so they don't come off. We're gonna get them from both ends, bend them upwards, making the track more manageable, soften the track to be able to fit them perfectly well correctly next to our lash line. We're gonna start from the middle, from the inner corner and the outer corner making sure they are next to our lash line. With our fingers, we're gonna bring the inner corner down and the outer corner up. We can even uh, uh, use our tweezers to help us to do this very delicate work. You see? And it's gonna give us a beautiful almond shape. There it is. Here they are, beautiful false lashes, very well placed, very sexy, and very natural. Another thing I wanted to mention, before we apply the false lashes, I applied liquid liner. You can do liquid liner or pencil liner, and I like to do it before, you can do it before, you can do it after, you can do it both before and after. And this is gonna give us, give us a more tailored and more polished look. She looks beautiful, huh? Now, I would like to show you a different technique to give us, this, this technique is gonna give us an even more natural look. From the inner corner, we're gonna pull the false lashes previously applied, making sure that we don't damage them. And from the outer corner, we're gonna cut about one third of the length of the track of the lashes. One third. And once again, apply glue and the remaining two thirds of the lashes. And we're gonna apply these two thirds of lashes in the outer corner of the eye and the outer corner, the remaining two-thirds, right next to the lash line, making sure it's really well placed, bringing the outer corner up with our fingers. And this is gonna give us our more natural winged eye, even more natural, almost totally unperceivable, Depending on the type of the event, you can choose the full track on the left eye or only the end lashes at the end of the eye and the right eye. Beautiful looks, two of them. It would be up to you depending on the type of the event that you have. Beautiful. Thank you, Ivy. Well, I hope you have found this tutorial useful and enjoyable. And do not forget to visit my website www.mymakeupbook.com or look for me on Facebook and click I like it. Stay tuned 
for more upcoming tutorials that I will be posting throughout the year. This will be of hair and makeup. Hope to see you then. She'll expose you.